practice no doubt it's very important but that helps us develop a right attitude but having wrong attitude and practicing will bring you negative results hello master puts it very emphatically that we have two components to the practice one is practice itself and second is attitude attitude is all about 95% of your success 5% is only towards the practices success practice no doubt it's very important because that helps us develop a right attitude but having wrong attitude and practicing will bring you negative results i was in pharmacy business and i learned after many mistakes that what matters what makes the pharmacy especially retail drug stores very successful is the location if you are a drug store right in front of the hospital you can never fail in business unless you are so stupid but everybody can see here is where i can get my medicine my prescriptions filled okay so in business world they say success of a business at least in those days nowadays it doesn't matter where you do your business because of the web and technology there too what is important is your address how easy to remember your address is your website address if it is too complicated people forget the name they can't visit you similarly in business world the location location and location three things in spiritual success also to my mind these three things are important attitude attitude and attitude okay. now what sort of attitude must i have see when i was practicing earlier and i started understanding the system better and better i started implementing rather it became very natural to me to anticipate morning meditation just when i am about to go to sleep something you wait for something you a sort of a longing starts in your heart that as soon as i wake up i need to meditate so with that attitude i go to sleep that my lord help me prepare me during this sleep so that i can meditate better in the morning then comes the idea to my mind that if you don't have passion the interest some sort of grace for spiritual success it becomes a very dry practice imagine relationship husband and wife and you are going for a movie and the movie starts at 4 o'clock and a boy goes to the theater at 3 o'clock and girl comes at 4 or 5 his world will end he said my god will she come you know the heart starts stopping it it's it gets to an extent that it will it, that fellow will collapse on the you know on the in front of the theater now do we have that sort of love do we have that sort of uh incredible longing for god realization i mean we may not have most of us don't have but if we can develop if we can cultivate this eventually then the realization can becomes just like that so it's very easy then 